today I'm back with another Amazon Custom Return General Merchandise Mystery Box. So this box weighs 30 pounds on the dot. So this is general merchandise, which means it could be Amazon Custom Returns of electronics, toys, sporting goods, housewares, pets, jewelry, clothes, tools. If you can dream it, it can be in it. So my cost on this was around 250 bucks and most items in this box are going to be like new or in new condition. Very, very few are actually like damaged or excessively used. You can get some damage and use, but the majority of items in this, in this box from the company I'm buying from who purchased liquidations from Amazon Direct, it's usually pretty good product. Here we go. I'm gonna crack this thing open. Let's see what magic is inside of this next Amazon mystery box. Here we go. I will give you a small sneak peek at the top of the box before we start. A little kind of like a teaser pick. Oh, okay. On top of it, it's still pretty secretive. What might be in it? Let me set this thing down. We'll get going. So most items in this box will be sold on our eBay store. Direct link in the description box is video to the eBay store right now with over 1,400 items available for sale. So something like this, the iSteam, this will be available in our eBay store. And most all items from this box, a good portion will be available on our eBay. I just heard a weird noise, kind of like a snake's hiss. Make sure there's not a snake in this box. How funny would that be? You probably see a grown man scream like a two-year-old child. I don't see, uh, I just heard this, this like snake sound or something like that. Anyway, maybe heard on camera, maybe not. Hmm. Guess it's okay. Here we go, we have the wireless dog fins. We've sold this on, on eBay a few times now. Not crazy expensive, I think it's like 30 bucks or so. Quite a few items in this box will be in like the $30 range. I see a record, I'm gonna pull this out next. We have some 41, does this look infected? Orange vinyl with color specs, like a limited edition one. Haven't listened to some 41 in probably like what, 20 years? It's been a long time. It's like a, like a foil, like a gold foil cover and record. Let me actually, I'm gonna look on the Amazon app really quick to see what Amazon charges for this record. Kind of like gauge price, do it quickly. Some items I'll, I'll look up on actual eBay solds, but some like this, I'll just quickly look up on Amazon if it'll scan the barcode. Okay, it's not working. But anyway, a record. <laughs> I won't spend too much time on it. Here we, oh, we got a missed, ooh, what is this? I see the words AMD. It's somebody like taped this thing shut. It's not factory tape. It's just somebody taped it before they returned it. I see the word AMD. Okay, what is this? Oh, it's like a, I think it's just like a coolant fan, right? What it looks like. So that's probably not very expensive in the grand scheme of things. Probably not an expensive item. You never know though. It is AMD. I just saw the AMD. My mind just went straight to something like expensive electronic item. That's okay. Let's see. Next, we have another brown box. It says intelligent heating heated gloves. So it is not winter time right now. Something like this is not actually, I'll, I'll keep it taped shut. It won't sell very quickly because it's not cold outside. This, for the Midwest right now in Indiana, this has been an excessively hot summer this year. Like we've been in, in the 90s every day now for probably a month at least, like every day. It's been an incredibly, incredibly hot summer this year. This thing's still factory sealed. We got a Honeywell thermostat. Let me see if I can get the Amazon app to actually work on this one. Quickly just look it up, kind of kind of see value. And it sells new for $33. It's still factory sealed too, so that's not bad right there. Followed up with, oh, looks like we have a firearm accessory. And we have 
Oh, it is a it is a flashlight. Okay, nothing crazy expensive. But the actual brand is just called Brilliant Torsia LED. So, yeah. A lot of the items in this boxes are going to be like in like the $20, $30 range. A lot of items are. Oh, we have a recharge. Oh, this is a, uh, uh, oh, what's it called? A headlamp. It's a open package item, obviously. <laughs> we have a headlamp. Brown is Klein Tools. Probably at least 10 bucks or so, I bet. Oh, this is a mount for a camera tripod. When you start getting into camera accessories, some of this stuff can get very expensive. This is uh, Desmond Photography is the brand. Back it has a barcode. I uh, like the camera stand I'm using right now for my camera. That stand is a Manfrotto something or other. It was like 200 and some dollars. It was, <laughs> camera stuff can get very expensive. All the accessories and all the the lighting, they can get expensive. Okay, this thing, okay, it's, it's 30 bucks. Not very expensive, but I mean, 30 bucks for just a little. This is the piece that would that you would set your camera like into, like the little mount. But, okay, a little some sum. Something new with tags. It says, Born Genuine Leather. Oh, it's like a, I guess a purse? Or is this, or is this like a man bag? Oh, let's, let's look at the barcode. Let's see what it says on Amazon. Amazon, this is called the Born Feral Crossbody Organizer, and it sells new, which color is this? Kind of like a dark brown. Looks like it's new for about 50 or $49. 49 Look at this crossbody. So I guess it's actually, that could almost be like a unisex bag. Kind of, I think. I know recently, my wife and I, we went to a card show, and I could have used like some kind of like a, I guess call it kind of like a man bag to carry all the all the cards in that I brought. I thought about just using like my laptop bag, which is what I should have done, but uh, I don't know. I think it's a little bit too small for me. <laughs> if, I, if I if I use this, people will be like, "Man, what is that big guy wearing? That looks weird." On <laughs> it could be kind of funny though, right? Here we go. These are right on top right now. We have a pair of Apple AirPod Pros. These are the newer ones. Let's see. Are they in there? There's the case. Here we go. Yep. Oh, those are really clean, too. Nice. They're in there. Got the charging case. AirPods. They're AirPod Pros. Go for like 130 bucks. 130 bucks. Nice. Let's see. We got a mystery box. Barcode says absolutely nothing what's, what, about what is in this box. What is this? A creative wooden puzzle. Oh, let me let me let me shut that. Probably shouldn't have opened it up. It'll probably just start spilling out on me. There we go. Shut it. Yeah, a creative wooden puzzle. I don't know really much about that. It cannot be this, that crazy expensive. Sometimes, though, things can surprise you. Things can surprise... Oh, that's kind of heavy. We have a pile stereo power amplifier with USB port. Obviously, it's a loose package, but on a lot of pasta like this, it's going to be like 30, 40 bucks as long as it works. 30, 40 bucks or so. Oh, we got a knife. What kind of knife did we get? Oh, a big old butcher knife. Big old thing. Looks like to be brand new. The brand is W-Y-E-Q-I-A-L-U-N. How you say that? I don't know. We'll call it the knife brand. <laughs> Why do you say that? Oh, we got a dash cam. This is the brand Ape Man dash cam. We've sold, I don't know how many of these things. Use like 20, 25 bucks. We've sold a bunch of them. Oh, we got a knife in here. 
A loose knife, no package. Well, that's stiff. Oh, man. I can't read the brand name. Sativian? Sativian? Wow, that's... That knife sticks. That's going to be work with a little bit. Let me actually look at this brand on eBay. I'm kind of curious. I've never heard of this brand. Okay, so looking on eBay, looks like with no packaging, maybe as high as 40 bucks. If I can get the blade to like work a little bit smoother, it sticks really bad. As high as 40. That's like the high range though. <laughs> we have, what is this? Amcrest. No packaging, no cords. I don't know. <laughs> I don't know. Let's see. Ron Hand binoculars. Binoculars always sell really well. Oh, that's still factory seal too. That's got the original seal on it. Noise. Ron Ron Han binoculars. Has no barcode, but look on, on eBay really quick. Looks like these sell for as high as about 30? 30 bucks? Oh, Nintendo Switch accessories sell those about five bucks locally. We have a facial tightener. Fixes wrinkles. It's still factory sealed. Has the original wrap on it. The brand is Infinite TEC. <laughs> it could be something good. We have, oh, another dog training collar. We have so many of those. A Microsoft disc. We just sold this disc on eBay for, what was it, 50, I think it was? 50 bucks? Still factor seal too, so it has a seal on it. Last time in this box, we have Boss Audio Systems three-way full range speakers. That's pretty nice. Let me look this up really fast just to see what they might sell for. So yeah, these might go, once again, for about 30 bucks, about 30 bucks, so that's everything. Uh, best things were the Apple AirPod. Those like what 130 brand new Windows disc like 50 60 um, Doesn't there's uh, quite a few items in like, in like the $30 range like a lot So yeah, this will be way over a double up so it'll 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 be profitable and there was a lot of brand new stuff in this box too. I mean factory sealed stuff factory sealed binoculars and skin tightener and speakers and that's actually overall this is actually a decent box. It had, a, it had some good value in it. Even even that 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 bag, that man kind of a man bag was like what 40, 50 bucks? Not too bad. This wasn't bad. This will be pretty decent profit, I think. So if you enjoyed this, feel free to go down below, click that subscribe button. I upload on this YouTube channel every single day. I've not missed an upload in four years. So come back daily to this YouTube channel for daily free content for you to watch.